Virgos. Happy Valentine's. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back, Virgos. Let's look in and see what is coming up for your Valentine. All right. This is the month of February 2021. These are timeless readings. Whenever you want to come back and look at these readings, you're looking for some questions, some answers. This is it because you have karma. All right, Virgos, let's look in. So Virgos, I see um, some sort of information is going to be coming out. All right, so Virgos, I expect some sort of information to come out. The energy of the month is here. You're dealing with some sort of a legal issue in the first week. Um, is the information going to be successful for you or is light shed on some sort of information about you, Virgos? So whenever the energy of the sun comes out, it is about some sort of information and it's in the upper opposite direction. So it is not some sort of a um, legal issue where you're going to be successful. No, no, no. It has to do with information that is coming out about you, Virgos, because karma is there. So recognize what is happening and um, try and work out the situation in this month, Virgos. So the Eight of Swords, people are recognizing and seeing something um, and uh, the Ace of Cups. So some of you are going to be finding out something about uh, a new love. Some of you is a new love. Some of you has uh, something about your kids. But whatever is transpiring, people are going to be recognizing something, Virgo. So be aware of this. It can over yourself. It can over your business. It can over your kids. It can over a love or someone who you were having some sort of affair. It's coming out. Wow. So we see justice is coming up. You're find, trying to find strength to deal with a situation. A cycle is over with some sort of a deceptive play that people had created. Was you, Virgo, the one who created this deceptive play with other people? It's a karmatic situation. It is coming out. Light is being shed on it. The energy of the sun is bringing out some sort of a information. And we see justice comes up on you, Virgos. Um, you are trying to find strength. A cycle is going to be over in the second week. And what we see here in the third week is that some sort of a um, play that you had with someone else is going to be coming out. Alrighty, let's move on. What's in your foundation? Um, you Virgos, some um, uh, information is coming out about you Virgos. And this information could be about money. But this information, what is coming out, you have to make a decision in order to get some sort of a new start. So whatever is happening in Transparent Virgos, you've got to be recognizing that some sort of information is going to be coming out. A whole lot of information is going to be coming out about you, Virgos. And you really have to be recognizing what was happening, what was transpiring, who and what and the games that was being played and that you, Virgos, are caught up with uh, people where money um, has been uh, showed up uh, and people are recognizing. A lot of you are trying to deal with some sort of a relationship, an affair that you have, and you want a new start with this person. So be aware. It's a karmatic situation. All right. So let's look at what is coming up in the first week. Justice is here um, over a project uh, information came out people are recognizing something about a project a business or some sort of a legal situation that you virgos brought to the table and you're not going to be winning you're not going to be winning because people are recognizing and seeing the truth of uh, um some money uh seeing the truth of yeah some money and the documentation and information they're recognizing. So you, Virgos, it is some sort of an information. It could be your business because um, this is the Seven of Pentacles. This is something that you are working on. And uh, information came out, Virgos, that uh, something that you tried to create some sort of an issue for someone else in the month of January or in the months before, and um, it, it, it you fall in this trap. So it's as if you created some sort of a trap for someone and you Virgos fall in the trap. So um, they're going to be recognizing that some of you Virgos had 
intercept information and took information that was uh, from someone else's business or um, someone else's project and they're recognizing that you Vir Virgos had some sort of a plane or had some sort of a hand in this so Virgos be careful um, what you do in uh, this month because a whole lot of information is going to be coming out and I see they're going to be going through your business and and and, and really investigating your business and is looking um, through your business okay then we're looking at the second week. The second week is a fire week where you're trying to find a strength to deal with some sort of a uh, business or at the workplace or your own business or you're collaborating with others and some sort of information is coming in and you're recognizing you're not happy with whoever you're working or whoever you're dealing with some sort of a business. You recognize that this is not the person for you. So this is going to be coming in in the second week because in the second week you're trying to find strength to deal with this person that recognizing I did not take on the right person or I did not open up myself for the right person because this person is not uh, um, aware of what I need to be done. And I see some of you Virgos are going to be recognizing that you have made some sort of a wrong decision in January and you're looking for a new person to fulfill some sort of a <clears throat> opening that you have. A lot of you Virgos could be that you are you took on a new job and you're recognizing yes this is not what I want. Um, in the second week you're going to be realizing yes this job is not what I want. This job is not what I was looking for. This is not what I wanted. So a lot of you Virgos are going to be really seriously looking um at a job situation because this is about you guys if you notice um there is um only in the major or corner people but here it is all about you and you're recognizing that you took on some sort of a job and this is too much for you so i see you virgos are going to be recognizing this in the second week um and you virgos are going to be really seeing um something over some sort of a information and documentation truth is going to be coming out light is going to be shed on some sort of information and documentation and you Virgos are connected to this in some sort of a way. In the third week is a hurt week so a, a, a bit of balance come in for you Virgos because you're doing it with air, uh, fire and hurt in the third week and a cycle is coming in. Some sort of a communication, some sort of a cycle is coming in. Um, you have to pay, uh, pay back someone. Okay, so it's as if you Virgos, and that is what I said, you created some sort of a problem um, for another person. And at the last week, they're going to be saying, Virgos, you got to pay because what you have done was not honest. And I see that um, the Virgos, they're going to be recognizing that you Virgos have done something. You tried to create some sort of a problem for someone else. And they're going to be saying, yes, but you have to pay. You have to pay um, out your contract. You have to pay this person. You have to pay the invoice. So whatever that was happening, it is definitely an invoice or paying out some sort of a contract. Um, and it can happen to you or it can be vice versa. But I see that you are the um, one that could be paid or because um, the money is coming in. Um, or some of you have to pay it out, especially people, business people have to pay it out. Other Virgos, it could be some sort of a payoff that is going to be coming in. Um, it's not a lot, but it is something that you can use. So, um, then when we look, um, we see um, you're not happy. A lot of you Virgos are not happy. A lot of you Virgos in the third week is not happy with a situation. It, with, whether it's with your job or with, it, with, it, with some sort of a um, situation that you're dealing with, you're not happy. And I see that in the third week, you're going to be making some sort of a decision in order to look for something else or someone else to resolve some sort of a situation because you're not very happy. You recognize that um, the people that you have on, on your team or some sort of a situation that is going on is not making you very happy and you're recognizing this. For a week, you're dealing with the energy of the devil and the energy of the devil is that you recognize that a partner um, or you were dealing with someone that you and this person um, decide to create some sort of a problem with some sort of a documentation. It didn't work out. It's not going to be working out in your favor. So 
um, Virgos, be aware. Um, if you decide in the fourth week to create some sort of an issue for someone else, it is not going to be working out and you're going to be falling on your face because whatever that you created for another person, you're definitely going to be falling on your face and people are going to be recognizing what was happening and what was transpiring and that you are um, not capable of balancing out the situation. So you Virgos are going to be in for a very karmatic uh, um, month of February um, for you Virgos because they're recognizing that some sort of an imbalance shift uh, is transparent and they're going to be recognizing this. So Virgos, be aware of this because some sort of an imbalance shift that is going to be coming up where people are recognizing that some of you Virgos has created a whole lot of karmas around yourself and you have to clear this karmas, okay? Then I see that you had collaborated with someone and uh, whoever you have collaborated with, uh, it didn't work out and uh, you are now recognizing I have to go in search of uh, someone else or something else. So, so it's, it's as if it, it, there is it, you're searching for something else. So it can be some of you with work, some of you with relationships. So, um, some of you begin a relationship and you recognize this is not the person, this is not where I want to be in. You are now looking for another person. You recognize that it's karmatic, karma that you have been going through and you're recognizing this and you are turning your back oh, to some sort of an issue and looking for better shores and looking for better people in order to collaborate with or in order to work with because you recognize you're not being fulfilled by someone or something in your life. Wow. So a lot of you are open in the first week, open for communication. Um, you're open for communication. A lot of you want to, um, you know, connect with other people. A lot of you come up with some sort of a crazy idea um, to make some sort of a money, but um, and you're looking if you can find people. So here you are, um, you know, looking out and seeing if you can connect and create some sort of a uh, connection with someone and looking where you can find people. So, it, it, you know, it's coming up as a business, but it comes up as love also. So it depends on what you're looking for. Is it that you're looking for a new job, a new business? Is it that you're looking for business partner? Is it um, that you're looking for new love? Because the love here is in reverse because you're dealing with some sort of a relationship problem. You decide no more to work on it because this is too hard for you. And you're looking um, further to recognize what it is that you want. So this is a month, Virgos, where a lot of things is going to be happening. Justice is here and you're having it hard um, with your business, Virgos. So recognize that. Then I see a lot of you, Virgos, are looking for like better paid jobs, better paid jobs, um, extra job um, to make extra financial, to make your, your, your financial meet. And this is going to be good. All right. Um, what numbers? Number two, duality is playing um, a great role. A lot of you are going to be receiving some sort of an invoice. Um, I see um, there are two businessmen and you businessmen are, are someone. I, I see you Virgos are uh, connecting with someone else to create some sort of a way of uh, creating a better finance in your life. But be careful what you're doing because whatever the thought is, it's not, it's not going to be working out. You're in karma. Whenever you're in karma, you cannot create. So it's not a month for you Virgos to do anything. I would advise you Virgos, don't make any um, decision. Um, if you make a decision in this month, you're going to be caught. So you got to be recognizing what is transpiring. So in love, you're dealing with a whole lot of karmatic relationship. And I see a lot of you are looking for new love in this month. You have the energy of the guardians of abundance. And it said, this is a time of great success for you, Virgos. All your plans are blessed and will move forward perfectly. Unexpected job opportunities arise in the future. Make sure to accept them. This um, cards indicate that someone with an amazing career is involved in, the, uh, in this situation. This is a powerful person with great integrity who enjoy hard work. This person could be you, Virgos. So, 
you know, it is a karmatic month. There is no question about it. Be, very, be, a, be aware of this and recognize that this month is very karmatic. So you have to recognize how you deal with certain things, Virgos, because this is going to be playing some sort of a significant role in your life. So recognize how and how, who you deal with in this month because it is going to be affecting you in the months going forward. I do love you guys. Show your love by thumbs up. Come back and check out the reading by Whitney Week in Week the Reading. Um, please remember to share, share, share. I do love you. Namaste. Until next time.